Among us there are dragons. Some are mighty, some are small. Such elusive dragons, most are never seen at all. But when the dragons gather to meet in storm-filled skies, their thunderous singing astounds us with their cries. There are different kinds of dragons. Some are good and some are mean, and their scales are many colors: red and purple, blue and green. Some live up on the mountain, some live beneath the sea, and all of them are magic, and all of them are free. The next morning, the dogs awoke to see a small blue dragon climbing onto the window sill. They thought they must be dreaming. "I hope I do not terrify you," said the dragon.、Uh, "What are you doing here?" asked Scotty. "I have only one day to earn four dragon merit badges. I must learn to fly. I must learn to sing." I must learn to breathe fire. I must learn to guard gold. I need your help, please. We've been waiting our whole lives to help a dragon," said Scotty. And the dogs leapt off the bed and raced out the door. Flying. Was the first merit badge the little blue dragon had to earn? Most adult dragons can cause hurricanes by merely flapping their wings. The little blue dragon appeared to be from a less gifted clan.
To fly has been achieved. The next task is to sing. Dragons have very deep voices. Mostly. <laughs> to sing has been achieved. Next, the little blue dragon must learn to breathe fire. Dragons light big fires. Except when they can't. Fires proved too dangerous for the little blue dragon, and he promised only to warm coffee and to light small campfires. To breathe fire has been achieved. The last task is to guard gold. Guarding gold is a time-honored occupation of dragons. The little blue dragon needed practice.
to guard gold has been achieved and all dragon merits accomplished. The dogs bid a fond farewell to the little blue dragon. It had been an exciting day and one they would long remember.